Guys, let's now move down to the kitchen. She has told you we are going to prepare a very delicious soup, and that is Eferendeya. Eferendeya. Eferendeya is fresh fish soup. So let's go to the kitchen and start cooking. We are going to show you all the ingredients we are going to use. So let's go. Follow, follow. <laughs> I have the fresh fish here. This is fresh fish. We call this ndegi yak. This ndegi yak. This ndegi yak is a very big one. You can see that this head, they had to cut it into two. They slice it. They slice the head. So I'm going to be cooking this. I have finished washing it with cold water. I'm still going to add warm water to remove the slimy. I also have the periwinkle here. This is the removed periwinkle. I'm going to be using the removed one because if you use the shelled periwinkle with fresh fish, trust me, you will not remove anything. All the fish will be scattered because it is fresh. So I'm going to be using the removed fresh um, periwinkle, okay? This is the eggs. You can see that this eggs is so plenty because the fish was a female one. I'm going to also add the okra. This is etri. Hey, etri beni yai korotong eti diro tu foro waronwa. So this is what I'm going to be preparing right away. What I'm going to do now is to add warm water or hot water to this fish and remove the slimy. I'm going to add hot water. This is how I was taught. So you can use anything. Some people normally use um, lime and uh, so many other things, but I like using hot water. Look at the body. See, it's going to remove the slimy. Look at how clean the thing is. I have to remove this water, then add cold water and wash it off. I also have some chopped onions here. This is fresh onions and also some seasonings. To crown it all, this is a tinkeni. We call this a tinkeni in my language. This is ozuza leaf. It used to have a very nice aroma. So I'll be adding this to the fresh fish. Guys, this is the fish after steaming. I have to take it out from the sauce because I don't want it to scatter. Remember, it is fresh fish. So after preparing my sauce, I'm going to lower it down gently and then my soup is ready. And the last thing I'll be adding would be this scent leaf, okay? So just keep watching. Guys, after adding everything, including the okra, I have to test for salt. Hmm, this is nice. The last thing is to add the fish. Here is the fish. I'm going to lower the fish gently. Oh, I pray it should not scatter. After adding the fish, I'm not going to stay it other than just shaking the pot so that it will not scatter. I'm going to add the scent leaf. Remember, the leaf always comes last. And in the next two seconds, it's going to be ready because everything is well cooked. 